I'm O'Brien. Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's a TGIF, folks. Let's make it a great night, great weekend. Surrender and let go of the past. Whatever life takes away from you, let it go. When you surrender and let go of the past, you allow yourself to be fully alive in the moment. Letting go of the past means that you can enjoy the dream that is happening right here, right now. Market-wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 47, Nasdaq's down 15, S&P's up 4.5, gold contract down $7.10, trading at 2002 an ounce. We have silver down 16 cents, twenty-four dollars seventy-nine cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up a, where are you? Up a dollar forty-four, trading out at seventy-seven dollars nine cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. The ten-year note up two ticks, trading one twelve oh six. The thirty-year up three at one twenty-six oh nine. And king dollar. King dollar is trading up two hundred and eighteen ticks at one oh one zero nine eight. The euro is at one eleven. The yen is at one forty-one. The British pound is at 128 to 1 U.S. dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? I'm going to go to the world of the NDX first because that's coming into its lows first. You know, we just did that update. They, had, they both have the high volume low. It's coming into this bar, so this bar is going to be crucial because we're dealing with Let's get look at this. Okay, so you got an expansion of volume happening. We haven't hit the bar. This is where it always gets dangerous, folks, meaning you'll go lower. Because the bar that we're talking about is at the, uh, what was that? 49. Oh, we just blew it away. Yeah, this is going lower, man. Okay, so that just blew that out. Let me see what the, yeah, let me see what the S&Ps just did. We got the S&Ps, and I just might have to. Okay, let's take a look at this S&P then. That's quite a bar. That's an expansion too. Okay, so this bar here, we're still going after the low on the S&P, which is 61. And you get a minute left. And that's going to stall, it's going to stall before it. But you get the expansion. The expansion of bar volume is happening. So this is going to open close to it. And I suspect what we're going to get, that's going to blow it away also. Because what we just did, we blew the NASDAQ away. And we now, now this is interesting. Okay, so you got underneath it, but you didn't get underneath it with volume. You know, we did, the NASDAQ did 13,000 contracts. Uh, the last swing, it, it hit the last swing. That was only 11,000. Took that baby out. The bigger one was 24. But what you're going to have here, because of the fact of the way that the uh, you got to keep an eye on this like a hawk, man. <laughs> oh, my God. This is going to be a trip. Okay. Um, let's go over to the dollar next because simultaneously, if this dollar ever rises just slightly coming into the close, it's going to get interesting because you got to remember coming into this close, what you're going to have. So the dollar is up 219 ticks. No big deal, but when you do put it on a weekly, they finally got to get, got to, got to get a bounce going. You can see the bounce that we got going. If we do a, let's see what we got here. Bring this in. So we're, so let's, hey, listen, it's saying, it's saying the dollar wants to do a 5 -0 bounce. That's 101.530. And that would make sense too, because the 101.530, okay, if you pull this in, now look at this, watch this. Because if we put this, oh my God, we lay this up, it's the 101 500 area where we did break down from, you know? So, that's right, keep moving, man. Um, so that would make sense that that's exactly how this thing would shake out. Gold, we go to the gold contract, we take a look at the gold contract. Gold contract pulling back with light volume. Got 149,000 contracts. You're pulling back into over 200. 
whoops. Okay, so this baby here, you can see we, the, the low of that 200, that strength was started at 1958. We went from 19, oh, that's interesting. It went right to 1958 too, man. You gotta love that. So we went right to 1958. The bottom line is that you did reject lower price, and that's where that big bar is, okay? The, the bar had uh, 264,000 contracts. We've only done 149. That's what you want to see, folks. And then you're also coming into 271,000. So bottom line is that gold wants higher price. That's how this baby's set up right now. We take a look at some of the higher volume. Well, actually, let's go to the bond market. Take a look at the bond market out here. T, the 10-year. We take a look at the 10-year. 10-year now up two ticks. That's on the, on the daily. We came down hard yesterday, but when we came down yesterday, what we also did is that you were also going right into volume. So you were going into, yeah, see, yesterday we were going into 204,000 contracts. We came into that the uh, third, let's see, we came into that yesterday with 1.5. So bottom line is that, and this is what's really going to get bizarre, is that notes and bonds want higher price. Higher price, lower yield, which is going to be just pretty wild, just shaking, shaking out itself. If we take a look at the 10-year as to what it's uh, yielding right now, it's yielding 3.8. I know I'm doing a million things at once here, folks, because there's nothing like option expiration. We have option expiration every day, but this one's going to be really interesting, man. Anyway, we're yielding 3.837 right now. Some of the higher volume equities that we have out here, let's take a look at them. You have uh, Tesla's, uh, well, let's go into the NDX first. So if we take a look at the NDX 100, you have uh, Qualcomm's up 3.4%. You got Illumina up 3.2. Texas Instruments up 2.1. And IDEX Pharmaceuticals up 2.3. Take it away from it. Sirius Satellite down 9.7%. That was up big yesterday. It's down 9.7 today. Unreal. CSX uh, off 3.5. You got Toyota Surgical off 3.2. And Facebook is off 2.9. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. <laughs>